I just wanted to know, do you guys have the added Italian original chicken sandwich back? Yes, we do. Great. I'd like to have one of those, and that should be it. Thank you very much. All right, we got the sandwich. Now let's do it. Hey, good to see everyone today on this wonderful, incredible day. Today we are trying a new kind of slash returning item at Burger King that I think you might be a little pleased in. We'll see how it goes. My son is Zach, I am Dad, and together we're Zach and Dad. Hey, thanks for checking us out today uh, on the Th Zach and Dads. We do really appreciate that you tune that dial on to us today. Uh, we are the place for food reviews, food challenges, and good old Burger King kind of fun. So if you like what you see here, which we really hope you do, please like, subscribe, and hit that where Zach would be. Hit that bell for notifications so you never miss a great beat. Well, again, today I'm sunless. Um, well, you could probably try. You can probably see by my skin I'm usually pretty sunless. But today I'm literally I'm sunless again. Uh, Zach's at school, and uh, I wanted to kind of during my lunch hour I wanted I, I kind of wanted to hit this product again with him being busy. We're kind of doing halftime sometimes with him, sometimes with me. But I know you guys like it when we do this, uh, no matter whether with with or without the duo. Uh, you like how we continue to do this because uh, new items are out there and you want to make a better decision on your dollars. So we want to help you and we want to be part, uh, not only of your fun, because uh, I know some of you watch us just for the fun of it, uh, to make your day, but also for uh, information so you can make a better decision on your uh, on your food uh, on your food buying. So Today, what we're going to do is uh, Burger King, uh, it, it, it's kind of a new item for probably a lot of us because we've never had it before, but Burger King welcomes back, and I heard it was back a long time ago. I never tried this before. I don't remember trying it before, but Burger King welcomes back. I guess it's a fan favorite. I always find that so funny when they're like, we are returning a fan favorite. Uh, because I never remember anyone saying they wanted it back. I never saw a petition that they wanted it back. I never saw anything on the social medias that they wanted it back. But apparently Burger King said they're welcoming back a fan favorite. It's so favorite, I never heard of it. The Italian original chicken sandwich. The original chicken sandwich, I've heard. But never the Italian, Italian one. As the fast food chain's latest limited time menu offer. Give us a thumbs up. Do you remember the original, the original, uh, uh, that's, this is kind of how I grew up. It's kind of nostalgic, but my early days at Burger King, I remember they had the, the, the long, like hoagie, like bun with the, with the long breaded chicken sandwich with the mayo and lettuce on it. That is what I remember as like the original chicken sandwich growing up at Burger King. I liked it. That was my favorite. It felt like it was huge and I was able to have that. So this is what it is. It's combining the original uh, with a little bit of an Italian flair on it. So let's kind of get into it. The price is the only, is, is first of all disappointing to me. Um, it was $5.60 with tax. It was $5.69 for the sandwich itself. So at a fast food place for a sandwich to have that by itself, I want to be kind of impressed. So we'll see, we'll see what this is. So here's the bag. Napkins, or napkin, I should say. Kind of comes in this nifty difty kind of wrapper. We'll see how it looks. We'll give you a close-up. Don't worry about it. And, you know, of course, something will fall down, I'm sure. It's usually what always happens is something falls. But anyway, this is what it looks like. Um, what I'll do is I will just show you kind of like the side glance of this as I talk about it. It says here that the Italian original chicken features an original long white meat chicken patty, which the original one did from uh, my younger younger days when I actually had red hair. Uh, lightly breaded and topped with two slices of mozzarella cheese and marinara sauce. I'm not a huge marinara fan, but we'll see how it is. On a long sesame seed bun. Again, this is kind of what the original, if you minus like all the extra toppings, this is what the original chicken sandwich basically used to be. Burger King had it. When I think of chicken sandwiches, that's what I think of too. Uh, let's open the hood and let's kind of see what we got here, uh, if I can. That mozzarella is kind of melted, so it's kind of hard. Uh, opening it up without kind of tearing the bun. 
Um, but as you can see here, it is steamy, which is great. I like to see the steaminess there. Uh, you can see the marinara sauce. You can definitely see the cheese. Um, you can see the breaded uh, chicken in there. There is no lettuce uh, in here. Um, it's just basically that sauce and the cheese. Uh, the bottom is plain, uh, which disappoints me. I kind of like it when you put, you know, maybe something at the bottom, mayo or a little more cheese to add to the, um, I guess, moisture uh, to the to the burger uh, or to the to the chicken. It feels warm. Um, it smells good, actually. It really does smell good with the cheese and the sauce and the chicken. But you know what? We can look at it. Actually, what I'll do is I'll even tear it out. Let's see if it has that cheese pull. Not a real cheese pull. Uh, but you can see there kind of across. I don't know if with the lighting in here. It's kind of it's kind of a cloudy day here in Wisconsin. Um, it's fall. The hours turn back. And usually here in Wisconsin, fall is pretty much cloudy. And so that's kind of what it is here today. So anyway, without further ado, uh, let's give this out again. This is the Burger King's Italian Original Chicken Sandwich. So, chip it and dip it. I'm going to go in for a second bite and then I'll let you know what I think. First of all, I'm not sure if people are attracted to people in cars that talk to themselves or not. But again, I'm right next to Burger King in this huge, empty, abandoned parking lot that used to be used to be a Home Depot. It hasn't been Home Depot for years, so it's an empty parking lot. But wouldn't you know what? I'm in the middle of it. It's empty. And now someone not too far from me just happens to park there. And so it's kind of like, you know, they see someone talking to themselves and they're interested. I'm not sure. Anyway, um, I, I'm glad I got it warm because the cheese still really kind of had that really nice melted taste. If this was, if I waited a little longer, I think I wouldn't like it as much. I think the cheese would have hardened in that. But I can taste the chicken, that breaded chicken. I do like that breaded chicken. It'd be interesting to see how it would be. It, it almost tastes like a chicken Parmesan sandwich is really what it is. I love a chicken Parmesan. When I go to Italian places, I always go chicken Parmesan. This kind of reminds me of that. Be interesting if Burger King would have a ch uh, grilled chicken, grilled chicken version of this. I bet that would be good too, especially for those who wanted a little more healthy with the grilled chicken. But this was good. The breaded chicken was good. Uh, the bread is really good, really nice and soft. I really enjoyed, if you can see that sesame seed bun, I uh, really enjoyed that. Uh, the cheese in there is good. Um, oh, there's a little, I guess, uh, inside of, if you can see it there, of the, actually, I just cut the chicken open. Uh, it's still pretty warm. Um, I would have liked a little something at the bottom for, you know, funsies, I guess. Some, um, either maybe a little bit of mayo, a little, make it a little more moist, or uh, a little more cheese, uh, or even sauce. Something there. I like that when you can surround that where it's just not on top, but it's really good. I would recommend it. Give it a try. Again, it's only for a limited time. Uh, definitely go give it a try. Um, I actually like this. I've had ups and downs with the chicken uh, sandwich. I really, really liked it at first. We'll put a card up on how we thought of it at first. We really loved it at first. Then we tried it again and it really stunk. Um, I actually really think this is actually almost better than that. Really good. Kind of brings me back to, to my to the early days when I liked that original bun. Give me a thumbs up again if you remember that. Before I give a flavor rating, of course, I'm going to ask you some questions. And why do I do that? It's because this is social media and I want to interact. It's not just me talking to you, but I want to, I want to hear back from you. I want to hear back from our family. And you know I'm going to uh, comment, uh, unless you're way off back, unless you're way off your rocker. Um, I usually, you know, will, you know, will write you back because uh, I appreciate each one of you. Some of you just, you know, want your 10 seconds of fame and I usually I uh, don't respond to that uh, to really weird comments but to most of you know I will respond back so I want this to be a dialogue not a monologue let me know if you've had this what did you think so my first question is give me a thumbs up have do you like Burger King is a Burger King uh you know when you have you know you have Burger King Dairy Queen when you have all the fast food lineups how often do you stop at a Burger King would you try what have you tried it uh, let me know it's been out for a little bit have you tried it would you try it uh, what is your, if burger, if you do stop at a Burger King, 
uh, anytime in your life, what do you get? What's the item? What do you, do you get? Fries? Do you get a burger? Do you get soda? What uh, What is your meal at Burger King? Uh, I would love to know that. I, I do. I, I do love to know those things, and I'll respond back accordingly. Um, and then are you on team, when it comes to your chicken sandwiches, no matter what it is, are you on team grilled? Or on team fried chicken, or I'd fried chicken. Are you in when it comes to your chicken sandwiches? Do you like it grilled, or do you like it fried? Um, I think it actually tastes better fried, probably because it's worse for you. Uh, but I also like grilled if it's proper. It depends too where it is, where it's at. Some places I like it better grilled than fried. Some places I really like Popeyes. I really like that crisp fried. Uh, chicken sandwich that they have. Where at McDonald's, I like a good, I like their uh, grilled chicken sandwiches. So let me know. All right, let's give a flavor rating for this. It was good. I'd recommend it. Was it my favorite? No. But I think I could, uh, I think I'd safely say I like and I'd recommend it. So here we go. Three, two, one, seven. And I'm giving it a solid seven. Uh, there's a lot more better things out there. Uh, a lot better chicken sandwiches out there. But this was good. Brought me back to my days. Um, I think they're trying. It's, they're representing. Again, it's for a limited time. So go out there. Give it a try. Let me know if you agree with my number or if you think it's too high or too low. Uh, I really would like to know that. Um, thanks for being with us today. Uh, if you like what you see here and you want to stay connected, uh, again, sometimes I'm here with my son. That's why we're called Zach and Dad. Uh, but we want to keep this show going. So when he's busy with his stuff, uh, we're just going to keep going, even if it's just me. So thanks for being with us today. If you like what you see here, which we really hope you do, please like, comment, uh, subscribe. Uh, we really would love those. Uh, and um, again, we're getting really close to monetization. All we need is more watch hours. So if the more you can watch these videos, uh, the better. Uh, like us on the Facebooks. Uh, we, I do correspond with you on Facebooks as well. That can be a little more personal that way. That would be great. And again, we know, I know that there's a thousand, because I watch a lot of them, there's a thousand other channels out there uh, that have done this review and that have done other food reviews. There are family review, food reviewers out there. There are, you know, just dads out there, whatever. There's a lot of other food review channels out there on the YouTubes. But I thank you for taking your small little YouTube experience today to spend time with a dad and usually a son that love to do what we love to do. We love to review foods so that you can make a better choice on the budget dollars especially now everything is going up, you have choices to make and we want to help you with those choices. So thanks for being with us today. We truly love you and we care about each one of our family members out there. And as we always end, and I know Zach would be with me here, we'll see you on the flippity flop. God bless you guys. Take care and we'll see you on the next video.